<clears throat> okay, welcome back to Sanity Maintenance. This is a radio head coming for install, and I also own one of these myself. And these things basically come out of the box with, you know, a damn good radio. That's all I can say about these radios. Uh, the GX uh, 2200 has built in GPS. That's something you'll have to screw with or anything, it's built into the front of it. Uh, it does not come with the RAM here. Uh, it does come in uh, with two colors, white or black. Good luck finding either one of them. I'm not really sure if they even make these radios anymore. <clears throat> I, I've had a hard time trying to get, you know, looking for another black one. This is black here. That he got, how he got it, I have no clue and where he got it from, he didn't say. But uh, like I said, this was an install coming in. But uh, I have nothing but good things to say about this radio. It is really good radio. Uh, it does have the AIS receiver and display. And on, uh, on your DSC, it has the transceiver. Uh, if you want to know what all these differences is, the best thing to do is look it up and read it. Because that's like a 12-beer video. Because there's so much technical stuff in there with it. But I have nothing bad to, to say about it. And it's really nice because it has all the stuff on here where you can see other ships and things, which is nice. If they have the devices hooked up and they're running like they're supposed to. Just a great radio all the way around. You can hook up other things to them, like the RAM. You give them white or black. I don't know what they cost now, uh, but I think they're probably over 100 bucks. Uh, I never care too much for the non-powered uh, version of the uh, speakers that they have. The powered versions, I really like them because you can adjust how loud you want it or whatever, and they're really nice. They were over 100 bucks as well, but uh, definitely nothing bad to say about this radio. Like I said, it came in as an install, and this is. These are really good radios, and uh, this, as far as I'm concerned, the one we have, it is excellent. I think we get right around 400 for hours, and this one here, I think you pay well over five for it. So uh, they're hard to find. I do know that. Like I said, I don't know if they make them no more or not, but it, they're out there somewhere because he got this one. But these are great radios. Uh, I see them a lot on the Deadliest Catch stuff, and I also see them a lot in ships and things like that too. It, it, they're bulletproof, pretty much. You know, don't don't shoot the damn thing but they're, they're pretty much bulletproof they are good radios i have nothing bad to say about this whatsoever displays easy to read everything's just perfect about this radio so this is my review and my input on this radio have a nice evening